everything okay with the missus? Well, Rama's not a surgeon. I mean, maybe she doesn't get that drive to excel. Robin has an amazing ability to always be right when it comes to me. And there's my two best girls now. Mama needs to stop with our good night kisses from Daddy. Come here. <laughs> Hi, honey. You sure you don't want me to drive to the airport? I got a beautiful souped-up minivan downstairs with cup holders now. I still know how to kick it. Oh, it's okay. Finish your shift. I mean, you can't really come to the gate anyway. Hmm. Listen to me. If you start speaking in a British accent when you come back, I'm not going to be happy with you. Okay? Okay, let me at least get you to the elevator. Okay. Uh oh. Hi. You're going to be late? Not yet, but I mean, if we wait for you. Okay. I love you, sweetheart. Have fun. Bye, baby. Bye. I love Call you. Me when you're about to take off. Ooh. Oh, come on. Say bye, Daddy. Let go. Say bye bye. Okay, bye. Bye. Hi, you. sweetie. We miss you. Bye-bye. Dr. Howard, cardiology. Dr. Beverly Howard. Oh, see. She missed. Dr. Drake. Nicholas is in love with Elizabeth. So you had no idea. This is so random. What makes you think? This. I overheard Nicholas pouring out his heart to Elizabeth, and I confronted him. He didn't deny it. What did Elizabeth say about all this? She admitted that he's been pursuing her for some time. I, I don't even know what to say uh, about this. I, I've been confiding in Nicholas uh, about everything. I mean, about my relationship with Elizabeth, everything we've been going through. I mean, I can't help thinking that he, he's been looking for information to work his own agenda. N Nicholas is... Messed up. He just, he hasn't been right since Emily died. I'm not interested in using Emily's death as an excuse for him just anymore. Just trying to get my head around this. Nicholas doesn't have a prayer of taking Elizabeth away. She loves you. You all go. I, I can stay here with Dad. But you have to come. Look, I just got pulled over for drunk driving. It's not much of a punishment, a ski trip to Vermont. First of all, you don't get to pick your punishment. And second of all, you have to come. It won't be any fun without you. Yeah, your mother's right. Two words. Mom, skis. Yeah, that would be something to see, but, you know, I should probably just stay here with Dad. Mm. You know, Michael, we've, we've all been through a lot. This is a chance for us to put our troubles behind us as a family. Look, this family sticks together. If you're not going, I'm not going. Me neither. I'm out, too. <laughs> yeah, and you know, Jocelyn, well, she won't go without her big brother, so she's <laughs> yeah, not going either. Help. I guess there's no way I can miss Mom wiping out in the bunny slopes. Awesome. <laughs> bunny slope? Who do you think you guys are talking to? You just wait. First day, I'm going to be flying down the mountain grinding out airs. <laughs> <laughs> what? Well, Franco will make contact when he's ready. So, what happens now? Well, we wait for the autopsy report on Claudia and hope there's nothing that can implicate Michael. You know, I've been meaning to tell you. Thank you for choosing to save my life. There's never a choice. Do I need to be invisible to just survive or Let's go for a ride. Try so hard to quiet my expensive dream before they take me. Guts, I'll give you that. I 
respect you, Johnny, and I uh, hope that goes both ways. You and I share one thing, all right? That's our agenda. Don't make the mistake of confusing it with friendship or respect, all right? Uh, is Stone Cold on the premises, or, or Mr. Sir? Uh, neither. Why, what do you got? You got news? What? How is this, Spinelli? I've been monitoring the PCPD mainframe. The uh, autopsy and the body from the explosion. Yeah. Uh, the preliminary report is in. The deceased is indeed Claudia. You have my most heartfelt sympathy at this confirmation. How'd she die? Blunt force trauma to the head. It looks like this just became a murder investigation. 